The engine is running, the body comes down, an incredible story. The Blue Max of Raymond Beetle is running and ready to go. An incredible rebuild job. They stripped this car to the bare chassis. They put a new engine in, a new parachute on, new safety belts after that devastating fire in the previous round. A pair of Texans matching up here. Ray Beetle, number one in the world last season. Billy Meyer is number four. A tribute to the crew of Dale Emery, Fred Miller, and D. Gant to get this car to the position that it is right now, running and doing its burnout in the semifinal. Beetle backing up, and Billy Meyer can't back up. He's got problems. If he comes across that center line, and he did, he is out of competition. He's driving the car back up to the starting line. And this is a sight you very rarely see on any drag strip. Two cars coming at each other head on. The Blue Max against Billy Meyer. Meyer coming around him and passing him. Heading back behind the starting line area. As Beatles crew concentrating on their car, they know what happens when you cross the center line, you go out of racing. So it will be a single for Beatle as Billy Meyer, a very unhappy young man, tells his crew that something apparently went wrong with the reverser and he couldn't back up. Beatle on a very, very strong run. And there is low elapsed time of funny car eliminations, 6.04 seconds, and that on a completely rebuilt car. His speed, 227 miles an hour. Billy Meyer stripping off his fire suit, heads back through the staging lane. Well, even though you had already spent your uh, arsenal of engines, you sure didn't take it easy. Low ET of the meet 604, Raymond. Well, we thought we'd run good. You know, we've been having trouble, Steve. I'll say you've been having trouble. Well, when we saw Billy uh, break his reverser, well, you know, that made me feel a lot better because I knew unless we change the rules, all of a sudden you can't cross the center line. That's right. And everybody in the pits is saying only Raymond Beetle and only in Texas could this have happened to just completely overhaul this car from seat belts to fire suit to everything. Well, like I said, I knew we ran really good because when I ran, I blew the windshield in, so I knew I ran really good. A broken windshield in the Blue Max. I'm sure you must have another windshield, too. Sure enough. <laughs> <laughs> I figured you did. So it's back to the pits and more work for the Blue Max crew. 